Understanding, set equal to zero. A guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a phrase often used in mathematics and problem solving. Set equal to zero. This phrase is not only vital in understanding mathematical concepts but also in grasping the language used in various academic and professional settings. Let's break it down together. Set equal to zero is a phrase commonly used in mathematics and science. It means making a value or an expression equal to zero. This is often done to solve equations or to find the value of an unknown variable. For instance, in the equation x plus 5 equals 0, we have set x plus 5 equal to 0 to find the value of x. In mathematics, setting an expression equal to 0 is a crucial step in solving various types of problems. For example, in algebra, to find the roots of a quadratic equation like x squared plus bx plus c equals 0, we set the equation equal to zero. This action is essential for applying mathematical methods like factoring or using the quadratic formula. Interestingly, the phrase can also be used metaphorically in everyday language. When someone says, let's set our differences equal to zero, they mean forgetting disagreements or starting afresh. It's a creative way to use mathematical language in daily conversations. For English language learners, this phrase might be confusing initially. Remember, set equal to zero doesn't mean that something is worthless or unimportant. In mathematics, it's a functional step in a process, and in everyday language, it's a metaphor for nullifying or neutralizing something. I hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, set equal to zero, in both a mathematical and a general context. Remember, understanding such phrases enhances not only your mathematical skills but also your English language proficiency. Stay curious and keep learning. See you in our next video.